Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Shane, coming at you. Uh, thought I'd do a little bit of a better review of my Stump Jumper Evo Expert. Um, had this thing now for probably, I don't know, eight months. Um, those of you that know, I'm an amputee below the knee on the left side. Um, I had to give up mountain biking for quite some time. I had a Trek hardtail. And I said that if I ever get back into it, I'm going to get like the bike of my dreams. And I really wanted a stump jumper. And the Specialized website just had this killer deal on the Evo Expert. Uh, with that, you get a Fox 36. You get a full carbon frame, carbon rear triangle. You get this nice dropper post. Though, with it at its tallest, I, uh, I won't lie, I'm not the most happy because it's a little bit too tall. Uh, you get the Fox float. And when I say this suspension is amazing, guys, it truly is. I'll come up on rock gardens or I'll come up short on a jump and I feel like, oh man, I'm going to eat it so hard and this bike just takes it. The suspension is so soft and with the adjustability that you have with everything, being able to lock it out, do the fast adjustments as well as slow speed adjustments. You can lock out the rear. The one thing that I've come to, to love and hate is the axis shifter. It is electric, so it does have a battery. So you have to remember that if you're not fully charged before a ride, you, you might end up stuck in a gear. Um, it's not the end of the world, but it does suck. Um, some things that I've kind of noticed that is on a negative side is if I come up and instead of hitting a rock like on the pedal, if I get right here, uh, sometimes the transmission of the shifter will switch gears for me, which sucks because it throws me off sometimes. Uh, these guide code R brakes, you will have to adjust them to your liking of how quickly they engage. But man, do they have like full stopping power. They're amazing. Um, they do come with the Deity grips, uh, which are actually really nice. They're a nice thick waffle core texture. Um, they kind of soften everything. However, these are my race face grips I had on my old mountain bike and they're purple. I'm a fan of color. If you haven't been able to tell um i love it i encourage everyone to get out if they can try something new um you know just challenge yourself every day life's short enjoy it while you can um i know uh carrytown bicycle company you can go and you can rent a bike for a day it's like 150 bucks uh, but if you decide to purchase that bike, they'll take the 150 off the off the price. Uh, but even with that, you can still go out, just rent a bike for the day, come to Pocahontas State Park, where there's plenty of people. Uh, there are so many trails uh, for you know just gravel trails. You've got uh, Corkscrew, which is one of my favorites. You've got Blueberry Trail. Uh, you've got some more challenging trails, which I have not been on yet. Um, I'm still struggling with keeping my left foot on the pedal where I want it to be. I need to go ahead and just get like one of those cages that holds your foot in place, like the old school. Uh, that would be amazing. Oh, that is, look at that Land Cruiser, guys. Those things are so stout. I would love to have one. That would be so dope. Oh, man. Oh, anyways, that's my little bit of a better review i'm gonna look into getting a bike mount so i can actually mount my my phone uh to my bike while i'm riding and try to get some riding segments be a little bit better who knows um i'm just happy that it's finally like fall uh past couple of weeks it's been pretty warm um and then we just like shifted into fall immediately it was uh 40 degrees last night with a high of 62 today and i mean it is just beautiful there is beautiful weather 
get outside, do something fun, go for a walk, have fun with your family, all your friends. But with that, you guys, take it easy. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.